water is flowing at a rate of 5 km per hour through a pipe of diameter 14 cm into a rectangular tank which is 50 meters long and 44 meters wide see water is flowing at a rate of through a cylindrical pipe like this is diameter they mentioned diameter so here the diameter is 14 cm so radius is 7 cm from this the water is flowing into a rectangular tank rectangular tank is nothing but here I'll take cuboid in cuboid length see here in cuboid they give the length length is 50 meters breadth is 44 meters determine the time in which this in which the level of the water in the tank will rise by 7 centimeters so height is 7 centimeters so we need to find in how much time the water level will rise to 7 centimeters here water is flowing at a rate of 5 kilometers through a pipe so this 5 kilometers is the length of the pipe so length is 5 kilometers see length of the pipe only will become like height of the cylinder height is 5 kilometers because if a cylinder is see if you will take like this cylinder this will be the length but if I hold it like this this will become the height of the cylinder so in the same way here radius is there height is there so this problems I told already like volume of cylinder volume of cylinder by time equals volume of cuboid by time because this is flowing 5 kilometers per hour so this tank will take how much time because the volume will be same okay volume will be same same water flows into this cylindrical tank so volume will be same so volume by time equals volume by time if you do directly you will get the answer now volume of cylinder formulas is like pi r square h by time time i'll take one hour because five kilometers per hour here volume of cuboid is l into b into h by we need to find the time in the time how much time will it take to fill this water by to a height of 7 centimeters so here I need to find x so it's very clear that I need to find the value of x now substitute the values like 22 by 7 into but before that here radius is 7 centimeters so height also write in terms of 7 centimeters in centimeters 5 into 1000 this is meters 5 into 1000 into 100 if I do that will become centimeter so here radius is 7 into 7 height is 5 into 1000 into 100 and here length is it is in meters so write this also in 50 into 100 this is 44 into 100 so length is 50 into 100 breadth is 44 into 100 height is 7 by x okay I need to find the value of x so what I'll do just I'll transpose then I'll start cancelling so I'll write x equals x I'll bring here this x value this is 50 into 100 into 44 into 100 into 7 so these are all values in the denominator there is 7 so transpose it you will get into 7 by all these values bring it to the denominator so 22 into 7 into 7 into 5 into 1000 into 100 now slowly you cancel you will get the time now see 100 and 100 two zeros two zeros one more zero is there you can cancel 7 7 7 7 5 5 so 22 times 1 22 times 2 so nothing is left you are left with like x equals 2 x equals 2 so to fill this tank it will take 2 hours so x equals 2 hours so time in which the level of the water in the tank will rise by 7 centimeters so time in which the level of the water in the tank water in the tank will rise by 7 centimeter 
is two hours so in this way you need to solve the problem see this problem most of the problems if you observe whenever there is like water is flowing from one place to another place i will solve the problem by taking volume by time equals volume by time it will be easy to get the answer so the answer here is two hours an important question because they asked 2017